Hi everyone, this is Paul Lang from Discipline Trading Strategies. I'm here with this week's Trade of the Week video. This is for the week ending 10 27 2019. The date this occurred was on Thursday, the 24th. The stock was AMAT, A M A T. The strategy was based on a tier one gap with an entry on a one minute major support DTS buy set at Management Simple, reward to risk 2.2 to 1. This is a classic, a favorite, and before we get to the charts, let me remind you of the free stuff this week. This week is the annual DTS Trading Room Open House. We'll only be having these once a year. This is only the second one since the opening week of DTS in over two years. So if you want to join us, it's going to be Tuesday and Wednesday, October 29th and 30th. If you want to join us, you'll be receiving an email that will give you instructions of exactly what to do. And also save the Monday evening before Tuesday, Monday the 28th. Probably at 5 o'clock, we're going to get together for a little training session and to take any questions about how the trading room works. On with the trade. Daily chart of AMAT. This is what the daily chart looked like the day before the trade. And that morning, the stock was going to be gapping. It was gapping to right there. And you can see that's what it looked like after the day of the trade. This was considered a tier 1 gap by me. 60-minute chart to give you a little better perception of what's going on. Right there is where the stock's going to open, just enough to clear that little stuff there. Not that it was necessarily all that critical. Boom, open, went straight higher. This particular trade, I did not enter at the open for two reasons. Number one, unbelievably, inexplicably, there was a second tier one gap this morning, and it was Ford short. It actually is even a better trade. I focus on this one because most of my trades I show in here are shorts. I want to show a long. I also have a new rule that I developed, a little change in my plan, where I am not doing any bullish gaps the opening 20 minutes unless it is really an extreme exception because in this tired market there seem to be less reliability and some of them going higher. So just personally I change that. I still will do them but only after the opening 30 minutes typically, sometimes a little bit sooner. The bearish gaps 100% as soon as I can. The Ford was a bearish gap. It worked uh, even better than this one I think. I think it made a little bit more money but I'm showing this one here. Ford is the symbol F. You can check it out. It was a gap down that day that was very similar to this gap up. So I ended up waiting on this one partly because I was doing another trade and because this is the one I preferred to wait on because it was a bullish gap. It could have been entered right at the open though. This thing just flew right out of the open. But where I got here was right there. I got a really incredible entry. If you check the chart, entry 53.58. It was just, just a few pennies off that low right in there. And I took a target on the way up at 53.95, a target on a nice surge before lunch, and then the last third was held end of the day, and literally took it pretty much just going into the close about 10-15 minutes into close that trailed out at 54.94. This particular day I had a couple trades open. I literally left for, I don't know, three, four hours from 11.30 to 3.30 or something like that. I don't know exactly when I was gone. And you can see this trade here, any management I would have done after 11 o'clock, I only would have lost money. It went right to the close, did beautiful, and so did a couple other trades that day. And to give you just a little better view of the entry, here's the one minute chart that shows you. You're not gonna learn a whole lot from this other than this is taken just right off of that before it hit its low. Actually on the way down, there's something I can show you how to do if you ever take class with me. Naturally, it doesn't work every single time, but it's a great entry that gives you fantastic odds. And from there, of course, the entry target one was taken, and then target two and three are off the charts, so you don't see them on this particular slide. This trade, like all the others done in the DTS trading room, come join us. You can take a trial for a week, or you can just join the room for a month. It's not terribly expensive, and I really believe even if you have a day, a morning every week that you can join us, I think it's worth it to get your feet in there and start learning what to do rather than waiting and trying to learn it all at once. Much better approach, start easing your way and start to understand how we trade as day traders. And remember also what I teach, I also like long-term position as well. So it's not just about day trading, it's also long-term. This is Paul for DTS. Until next time, good trading everybody.